You're making a bit of a habit of this, aren't you? Coming to Wembley, bringing 40 odd thousand supporters and then winning as well. Listen, it, it, it was such a hard season, a long, hard season. And to play in this heat, watching the playoff games up till now, been really tough watch because of the heat. You know, so we knew that it'd be probably a game of two halves, and thankfully we've scored some unbelievable goals and ended up once we got on top. I think maybe the demons from last year, Exeter, we spoke about that before, whether it had an impact or not or an influence, I don't know. Just some of the finishing was outstanding against a really good team. So I feel for them because that's the second time it's happened. Just absolutely delighted for these supporters because long suffering, you know, it's been on the slide all the way. And we managed to get ourselves back at the first attempt, which was really, really important. Just touching on the quality of the goals, you struggled to see two better finishes, weren't you? And then, of course, a deflection for the second goal, but the quality of those finishes was unbelievable. Through, from Grimmer and from Willis, unbelievable. And even from Shipley, because he's made his run from deep. He's got on the end of it, links up with Mark, Mark McNulty, and Spark has played a really well-weighted pass, and he's, he's struck it, even though it's taken a deflection. You know, it was just nice to see that nestle in the back of the net. It gave us a bit of breathing space. And also, I think the, the quality in the side of Mark McNulty, so obviously the, the man who leads the line for you scored a huge amount of goals this season but it's, it shows just how much quality you have in the squad when three other players have scored yeah I mean, two of those are kids you know tom bailey's and um, and shippers you know those are two kids that hadn't played before this season so credit to them you know the club keeps producing youngsters we've got to keep doing that um, we give them a we give them an opportunity and the stage is no bigger stage than this and, and even in the first half they did it they tried to do a job on them you know, they knew Bayliss's quality, they knew about Shipper's quality, but we've got quality with McNulty and Biamu, and then when Johnson Clark Harris came on, we get we caused them problems, but <coughs> this was about a one-off game, and you need a little bit of fortune. Whether we got fortune fortunate in the first in, in the semi-finals or today, it doesn't matter with one. And finally, just to wrap up, Mark, um, how important is it going to be that you can keep this group of players together to give yourselves a real good chance for next season? It's always important, but we have to do what we have to do to survive. So it gives, us a, it gives us a platform to get back to League One. We know how difficult that league it is, and, and in fairness, I've not even given it a thought yet. Um, we've got to enjoy tonight, that's for sure. Got to enjoy tonight, congratulations.